Hello, so today I'm going to show you how to create a shortcut for your desktop. So any of those websites that you constantly use, such as for me, Google Docs, and a few others, we're going to go and show you exactly how we would create a shortcut. So first, I'm going to go to the internet with Windows 7 for my keyboard. Windows 7. New tab dash Google Chrome. Address and search bar edit. So what I'm going to go to is audible.com because I really like Audible and I like to use it. A U D L E O M. So I'm going to type in the full address and hit enter. Enter. Audiobooks and original audio shows dash get more from Audible dash Google Chrome. Link graphic the UND audiobooks. Okay. So now we're here, this is where you can search and stuff, and um, it has UND audio. my name on here, uh, but it also is an area where you can go and look at your wish list and all that stuff. So right now we're just going to copy the URL to this particular page. How we're going to do that is Alt-D to get up to the address bar, or Control-L, they're both an option. I prefer Control-L. So I'm going to hit control L. We're going to go up into the address bar, control C to copy. And then we're just going to alt F4 out of this web page for the moment. So control L. Control L. Selected. HTTPS control copied. C for copy. And we're going to alt F4 out of this. Alt F4. Taskbar. Now we're going to go to our desktop by hitting Windows M. Windows M. Desktop, folder okay. view, list view. Now Zoom. we're going to hit control home. 10 of 17. To move to items, use the arrow keys. To edit the selection. Now we're going to hit control home to get to the very top of our desktop and make sure that nothing is selected. So control. Not selected, recycle bin. Good. One of we 17. We heard not selected, which is what we want. Now I'm going to do a right click. In this case, the right click that we're going to be doing is our JAWS key plus R9 on the keyboard. And it will bring up a list of things. Right click. Context menu. To navigate, press up or down arrow. And we're going to up arrow to new. Personalize. Display settings. New sub menu. We're going to hit enter. enter. Folder. F. There's choices of folder and the down arrow once to shortcut. Shortcut. S. We're going to enter. enter. Leaving menus. And on here it says type location of the item and we're just going to paste our URL there. So paste pasted. With, we pasted with control V and we're going to tab down to browse dot dot Next button. Next. Enter. Type a name for the shortcut colon edit. New internet shortcut. Now we can type in a name and I'm just going to call it Audible. U. I. E. Audible. And then you can either hit enter or finish button. tab to finish. Enter. Desktop. Folder view list view. And now we're back at the desktop and I can hit A for Audible and it will jump right to a. it. Acrobat Reader DC. Everything. Eight of eighteen. A. A. Audible. And there is our Audible desktop icon. Now I can hit Enter if I feel like it, and it will go directly to our Audible page. All right, guys. Thanks for listening.